بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ان دس سیکشن وی ویل ڈسکس ایکسرسائز 6.10 فرام ایڈیشنل میتھمیٹکس کورس فار ہائی جی سی ایس ای اینڈ او لیول اسٹوڈنٹس ان دس سیکشن وی ویل ڈسکس گرافیکل ریپرزینٹیشن آف ایکسپوننشیل فنکشن اینڈ لاگرتھمک فنکشن ان پارٹ ون کوشچن نمبر ون وی ویل ڈسکس دا ایکسپوننشیل فنکشن سو دا پلاٹنگ آف دس فنکشنس Uh, where we have to show the axis crossing points and uh, add them towards so for for this a to i we will discuss some of uh, this uh, graphical representation and similarly for the part two so let's start with this uh, exercise so the graph of uh, y is equal to k e power n x plus b a is a generalized form and here is y is equal to k ln a x plus b so this uh, is this kind of graphs will be discussed in this uh, uh, exercise uh, question number one y is equal to 2 e power x minus 4 so when x is equal to 0 this becomes 1 so 2 into 1 is 2 and 2 e minus 4 is, is minus 2 so when x is equal to 0 uh, y value is minus 2 when y is equal to 0 then it becomes 0 so 2 e power x minus 4 so this is e power x is equal to 2 so if we take the ln on both side then this becomes x is equal to ln 2 so we can see that when when x is uh, minus in plus infinity then y goes to infinity because this is positive so if x is infinity then y tends to infinity that when x is minus infinity then this becomes 0 so y becomes minus 4 so we see that when y is very very negative then if x value of x is very negative it's minus infinity then it's as them towards to y is equal to minus 4 this as them to take value for minus infinity this y is equal to minus 4 so this is the as them towards y is equal to 4 and for this value when x is equal to uh, 0 then y is equal to minus 2 that is represented here that is a crossing point and when when uh, x is equal to uh, y is equal to 0 on the x axis we have x is equal to ln 2 this is the point where the x axis is crossing this is the point where the y axis is crossing where x axis is crossing at 0 minus 2 and x axis is, is crossing at l and 2 comma 0 so this is the x intercept and this is the y intercept and this is as them towards when x tends to minus infinity for positive in infinity this will goes to the infinity so this is the representation of this is the final so let's uh, discuss uh, uh, problem number d where we have uh, y is equal to my uh, 2 e power minus x plus 6 when x is equal to 0 then then y is equal to 2 e power 0 so this is 1 so this is 2 plus 6 is equal to 8 so when y is equal to x is equal to 0 the value of is this is 0 comma it's it this is the x intercept y intercept because this y is crossing and x is 0 here and y is 8 and when x is equal to 0 this is obtained and when y is equal to 0 means on the x axis so when y is equal to 0 so this becomes e power this so uh, y never uh, reaches to 0 so this is minus e power minus x so this x axis will never be cut but when x tends to infinity this infinity then 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 this becomes 0 so positive 6 will be obtained so y is equal to 6 so this with x tends to infinity this y will reach plus 6 or will be as a towards to this one so this is the graphical representation this point uh, this curve will never cross this x axis but will cross the y axis at 0 8 and the as a towards is plus 6 so this is the graphical representation of it and let's uh, discuss uh, this uh, g function Jeez. Uh, y is equal to 4 e power 2x plus 1 when x is equal to 0 then this is uh, e power 0 this is 
becomes 1 and 4 plus 1 is 5. So when x is equal to 0, then y is equal to 0, 5. This is the y-intercept. And when y is equal to 0, then this becomes e power 2 is minus 1 over x. Taking ln on both sides, then this becomes uh, 2x is equal to 1. This. So this uh, never reaches this value. So, so this is... Uh, 5 so so this y intercept for uh, this is e power 2x is minus 1 over 4 so this x uh, 2x is equal to this so 1 over half uh, ln x so this uh, is never crossing the x axis so as I am told is 1 so x when x is minus infinity this becomes 0 and y becomes uh, y becomes plus 1. So this is plus 1 and this will never reach it. It will never reach. This is 1. So this is 0, 5 and this will never cross this x-axis. So it will add them towards to this 1. So this is so this is uh, g. And uh, Let's see this uh, last problem uh, i where we have uh, y is equal to e uh, power 4x plus 2 and minus e power 4x so when x is equal to 0 then this becomes 0 uh, so it's become 1 so this is minus 1 plus 2 so when x is equal to 0 y is equal to plus 1 when y is equal to 0 so this is 0 1 uh, is the uh, y intercept when y is equal to 0, then this becomes 0 is equal to this one. So this is e 4 power x is equal to 2. So taking log on both sides, this is 4x is equal to ln 2. So x is equal to ln 2 upon 4. So x is equal to 0.173. So this is this is when, when uh, y is equal to 0, y is equal to 0 or x axis then this becomes x becomes 0.173 so at y is equal to 0 this is 0.173 and it will further goes to f x tends to infinity this is infinity then y goes to infinity as per for x tends to minus infinity this becomes 0 and y is equal to 2 so y is equal to so the, the, for 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 infinity for infinity this becomes this becomes infinity for minus infinity this becomes 2 for a minus infinity on minus infinity side this is going to infinity for minus minus infinity this goes to 2 because this is my infinity so this becomes 0 and by reaches or as I'm told to y is equal to 2 so this is the intersecting point one intersecting point is this second y intercept is this and the Adam Tools value is this. Uh, in the second graph, uh, we are plotting some logarithmic functions. So we have y is equal to ln 2x plus 4. First problem, here we have x is equal to 0. When x is equal to 0, then y is equal to ln 4. ln 4 value is 1.386. So, so x is 0, y is equal to, uh, this is the y intercept this is y intercept for y is equal to 0 we have ln 2x plus 4 is equal to 0 taking exponential on both sides then this becomes 1 and this becomes 2x plus 4 equal to 1 so 2x plus 4 is equal to 1 means 2x is equal to 1 minus 4 so this is x equal to minus 3 upon 2 so this is minus 1.50 so this is minus 1.5 and 0 this is the x intercept and this is y intercept which is 0 ln 4 this is 0 ln 4 this is minus 1.50 this is the x intercept and when uh, x tends to infinity x tends to 
in uh, sorry when x tends to infinity y goes to infinity because x is increasing to infinity and then y is increasing to infinity for minus value minus infinity for this minus infinity minus infinity for x minus infinity this is all zero so y goes to this minus infinity the y goes to zero so y goes to minus infinity for so this is uh, when x uh, so y uh, sorry y is uh, minus infinity if we take y is equal to minus infinity here we can see this is uh, this is y if we if we take this y minus infinity then e raised to power exponential then this e power 2x plus so this is e power so this e power exponential means this is uh, infinity so e power minus infinity is 0 so this is 2x plus uh, 4 is equal to 0 so x is equal to minus 2 so this is x equal to minus 2 so th for this value y tends to minus infinity 2x plus 4 tends to 0 so x is equal to minus 2 so this is x is equal to minus 2 this graph is asymptotic to this one so this is in reverse so this is very very important so let's see the problem number d uh, let's see the problem see first y is equal to ln 8 minus 2x so for x is equal to 0 y is equal to ln 8 0 ln 8 is uh, x intercept so here value of x is equal to 0 uh, sorry y intercept this is y intercept because this x is 0 and y is ln 4 for y is equal to 0 for y is equal to 0 this is ln uh, 8 minus 2x and we take uh, exponential on both sides then this becomes e0 and 8 minus 2x so this 8 minus 2x is equal to 1 so 2x is equal to 8 minus 1 is 7 x is equal to 7 by 2 so 7 by 2 0 is the x intercept if y tends to infinity this if y tends to infinity then this this becomes so e power x is equal to 8 minus 2x so if this is infinity this is also infinity so if y is minus infinity this is minus infinity then this tends to 0 so 8 minus 2x is equal to 0 8 minus 2x tends to 0 so 2x is equal to 8 and x tends to 4 so x tends to 4 this is 4 and x tends to 4 so this is the graph representation this point this point and then as a proofs of this one so this is also very important and uh, this is uh, one of the last problem uh, here we have y is equal to minus 3 ln 6 x minus 9 when x is equal to 0 this is 0 uh, so this is ln minus 9 this is not possible so uh, what x is equal to 0 is not defined for this function so y is equal to 0 so for y is equal to 0 this is this and this is uh, 0 3 will be here divided by 3 so this is again 0 ln 6 x minus 9 this is e power 0 so this is uh, e power 0 is 1 so 6 x minus 9 is equal to 1 so 6 x is equal to 10 9 will be shifted here so this is 5 upon 3 so x is uh, 5 upon 3 and 2 0 is the x intercept and y intercept will not be obtained so x tends to infinity so then y is equal to tends to infinity x tends to infinity if, if this is infinity then log infinity is infinity so y will be infinity so for this is minus infinity so y is tends to minus infinity then if y tends to infinity minus infinity this is minus infinity then this becomes this becomes zero exponential we take the exponential then this becomes this so 
this is minus 3x and it tends to infinity so log 3 6x minus n is equal to minus infinity so 6x minus 9 tends to 0 because this is ln so if it, this is goes to minus infinity that tends to for exponential on both sides so it becomes 0 and this is 6x minus 9 so 6x is equal to 9 tends to 9 and x equal to 9 upon 6 that is 3 upon 2 so 3 upon 2 it will reach 3 upon 2 with x tends to minus infinity so y if y tends to infinity then x is equal to x approaches 3 by 2 this is the contours so in the next uh, chapter we will discuss exercise 6